Okay, hi guys. Hope you're following me. Um, I am an eBay power seller and top rated seller. I'm going to show you how to take a professional picture of a shoe and post it on your online store or on eBay. It's so easy. It takes about one minute. I'm using my camera that I use to actually take the pictures and I use a tripod. There's the tripod. The box is on the floor. I bought the shoe at Macy's or Bloomingdale's or somewhere. Just take it out of the box. There's the other shoe. Okay. I put it on a crate. So I stack up other boxes. And I use a white box and I turn it upside down. This is actually a coach box. I turned it upside down. I have the shoe. I just take the shoe out of the box. See the box? Take it out of the box. Put it on top of the white background with a white wall. The white wall is the best way to do it and you'll see why. Okay, here's the tripod. I place the camera on the tripod, screw the bottom of the camera into the tripod. It's so easy. I'm screwing it in. Done. Ready? I'm going to snap. Snap one picture there. Now, I already took these pictures because I am using the same camera to show you. So, I take a snap like that. Then I do the inside of the shoe. Snap. Then I do the front of the shoe. Snap. Then I do the bottom of the shoe. Stamp. Okay, how long did that take? Ten seconds? I unscrew it. You have to make sure you use the white box for the white wool. My wools are actually cream, but you'll see. Now, I take those pictures, and I take my connector, connect it into my camera, connect it into the computer over here, my USB, and I download the pictures onto my laptop. And there's my laptop, and I have, another, I have two computers. I just use two screens. The program I use is... Photo impression. Okay, so there's the photo impression. I am going to click on it, and it's I think it's 6.0. Pretty sure. Okay, so I'm going to open my photo impression. This is how easy it is. I mean, seriously, this is how easy it is. There it is, 6.5 photo impression gold. I'm open it up, and this will get you that perfect, clear, crystal white background with just the shoe. You'll see. So easy, guys. I already did a boot in a previous sketch. I did it on a marble background, which, you know, was a little bit harder. But now I'm going to do it on the white background. Now, I downloaded the pictures. Now i got to find it. I think I put it under Carson Coors, because that's the name of the shoe. And I'm in photo impression already. So I just click on the shoe. Let's do this one first. I'm going to do it the same way that I did it with, that I did the boot that you just saw. Okay, it's one, two, three. Edit. Photo editing tools. These are the three steps I do. Auto enhance, watch. See how it makes it brighter? Then I take the brightening tool, and I make it a little brighter, a little brighter. And I take the contrast tool, and I make it contrast, which is contrasting the shoe from the background. That's it. Done. Now to clean up the edges, we're going to say retouch, and it's going to say want to save the changes. Yeah, I'm going to save those changes. They look good. Here's the second tool I use. It's called the light and darken tool. It's the one all the way on the top right. So now I'm in retouch. Click on that. And see that circle? You can make it bigger or smaller. Big or small. Big or small. I'm going to use it medium like this. And I just take that circle, see? And I just go like this because I want to get rid of the light switch. Boom, boom. I'm getting rid of the hard edges. Boom, 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 boom. So I just do like this, like this. Okay. Guys, that's it. It's done. Done. Now, I go back to adjust, and I'm going to use the crop tool. This is the third tool I use. And I'm going to leave it on a 4 by 6 box. You can also do a custom box. I'll show you how to do the custom box. You just drag the box and you make it as big or small as you want. Now, the reason why I do this is because watch how much bigger the shoe will get. Because now I cut off those outside edges and I hit crop watch. The shoe will just pop forward. Watch. See that? Save as. Click on Save as. And I just want to replace it. I'm going to hit Save again. It says Replace. Yes done. Guys, that's it.
I just did the whole inside of the shoe. Now I'm going to X out of that, that picture, and you look at That's the inside. Now i got to do it to the outside, to the front, and to the bottom. And look how professional. And then you're going to import that into eBay. I will show you how to import that into eBay. Go, um, you'll find me on um, listing a professional looking picture on eBay. A uh, professional looking picture shoe on eBay. Okay? And that's it. All right? Maybe I'll do another one and I'll show you how to do the outside of the shoe and the front and the bottom. But we'll just make it short and sweet. So I'm going to say goodbye. Thank you.